In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys 14 psychological skills to master your life. So make sure you watch it to the very end because you are guaranteed to learn something in this video. The first skill is for you to build self-discipline. Build self-discipline. Be disciplined. Control yourself. There are some certain things that you try to stop, but due to the fact that you lack self-discipline, you have not been able to stop it. So the moment you begin to have self-discipline and self-control, your life automatically starts to change. So make sure you maintain and have and build self-discipline. Now, the next thing is for you to get rid of bad habits. There are some bad habits that are holding you back. And until you get rid of them, you cannot have a fulfilling life. So you must get rid of bad habits and stop worrying about the future. The future is ahead. So stop worrying about it. Instead, try to make good use of your time and make good use of your life. And the future will take care of itself. You can plan for it, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Then admit your mistakes. When you make a mistake, when you mess up, admit and stop trying to, to push the blame to someone else. Admit your faults, admit your mistakes. And then don't be afraid to fail. Don't be afraid to fail. A lot of times, there are so many people, they don't try because they are scared of failure. And if you're scared of failure, you cannot succeed. You cannot have a beautiful life. So don't be afraid to fail. Learn, try new things, try new things, learn skills. Just learn because when you learn, you see that you are actually good at it. But if you are scared, like if I start this business, would I fail? Or if I talk to her, will she turn me down? And then you ended, you end up not talking to her, but you had no idea if you had went, she would have actually spoken back at you and responded positively to you. So don't be afraid of failure. Now, the next thing is to choose simplicity. Choose simplicity. Let your life be simple. Only your, your look, your appearance it should be simple. You don't need to be too flashy and just show off or be too loud and obnoxious. Let your life be simple. Choose simplicity. Now, the next thing is to learn to say no when needed. Learn to say no when needed. This skill is something that if you learn it, it's absolutely going to help you in so many ways and it will make you master your life. So let us say no when needed. There are some times that some people will force you or want you to do what you do not want to do. So you should learn to say no when needed. Let go of the past. Let go of the past. Sometimes you are holding back of what happened in the past or an experience that happened or something bad happened or no was something good you are holding holding dear to it you need to let it go you need to let it go and forge ahead and move on with your life because there's so many things that you can achieve and you can accomplish but if you keep holding back and you keep looking behind you cannot move forward you can never see someone driving and is constantly looking at his rear view mirror that person is going to crash so if you don't want to crash your life stop looking back look ahead and forge your head. Yes, this one is very important and it's for you to make new friends. Make new friends. Be social. Associate with people. Get in communication with people. Reach out to them. Talk to them. And get to know them. Because in so doing, you are building your network. And your network is what improves your net worth. So, Learn to associate yourself with people and then Now, this skill is very important and so many times people neglect it. It's for you to give up jealousy. Don't be jealous of what someone had or be envious of one other person. Don't be jealous. It's not nice. It's not nice at all. If you're a guy and you're always jealous, it's a sign of weakness. So please don't be jealous. And this one is part, like my favorite, and that is starting your business, starting a business. Because when you begin to, to, to add value to people and they like it, definitely you get paid for it. So start a business. There are some businesses that are easy to start and it doesn't cost much. So businesses are easy to start and it doesn't cost much. So make sure you pick one and start. 
I would recommend if you're interested and you don't know what to do, you can start with affiliate marketing. I have personally gained a lot from affiliate marketing. And if you're interested, I could coach you and mentor you during the period of you coming into affiliate marketing. And I would also give you some opportunities and some platforms that I've used personally to make a lot of money for myself. So if you are interested in something like that and you want to start making money, just send me a message or WhatsApp. My, my number is on the screen. Get it and just send me a message that you are interested to know more about affiliate marketing. And I'll add you to my private WhatsApp group. It's free so that I can train you and teach you and show you how to do it, how to make a lot of money for yourself. Think more positively every day. Stop being negative. Remove negativity from your head. Remove negativity from your mind. Think positive things and think of things that would actually make you improve out, do better. No matter how the day is, no matter what you've gone through in the past, don't hold it. Don't let it hold you back. Always think positive and always say things that are positive and watch how your life is going to transform. And if you learn that skill, you'll be able to master your life. Appreciate what you have. A lot of times we are always looking at what we don't have, what we don't have. We need this, we need that. I want this, I want that. But you fail to be grateful for what you do have. You have life. You are alive. You have a smartphone to watch this video right now. So many people, they don't have smartphones. So you have internet to watch this video. So appreciate what you have. Because when you are appreciative of what you have, definitely more are going to come. So learn to appreciate what you have. And this leads to the final T, the final skill you should learn if you want to master your life. The final psychological skill to learn if you want to master your life is to always be grateful. Always be grateful to God. Always be grateful to the people around you. Always be grateful to those that have helped you. I've raised you up, that I've built you up to where you are right now. I'd also be grateful for the bad people that taught you some lesson. Because at the end of the day, you have an amazing life to live. So always be grateful for that. So that's it for me, gentlemen. I hope this video was helpful to you. If it was, feel free to drop a like on it and share it with your friends. These are 14 psychological skills to master your life. So until next time, always remember you are the prize. Yeah.